morning, good afternoon, beautiful people. I hope you're doing good. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, for my community, thank you so much for being here, for supporting me. I do really appreciate your support. For those who are new, thank you for dropping by and please consider subscribing. In this channel, we do um, experiences based on adventure, lifestyle and all the risks in between. And in today's episode, we are going to be visiting the Dubai Air Show uh, 2021, which has been uh, running from 14th of November to 18th of November. Today is the last day, and because some of us work under pressure, <laughs> we are going the last day. I'll gladly show you all the varieties of aircrafts, the future of aviation, and yeah, as I have shown you the uh, as I have shown you Expo 2020, all like um, the expectations from different countries, all the economic sectors also have their own like economic goals and. Dubai Air Show is a perfect example in the aviation industry, showing us the latest technologies, how artificial intelligence will be applied, how mobility will be a very, very awesome experience for you in the future. So see you uh, at Dubai Show and thank you for being here. So it's 8 a.m. and oh, I think this is the earliest I've woken up. Uh, I've woken up for the last few weeks. So I'm feeling like um, but yeah, I feel nice. So can't wait to get there. Your attention, please. The train to Expo 2020 will arrive at platform two. Oh, good afternoon, good people. It has been a long journey. <laughs> good afternoon. <laughs> so this is Sura. This is um, our sponsor for today's <laughs> video. <laughs> You're crazy. Yes. So we are at um, IBN Batuta station and yeah we're supposed to get a bus which is like in a few minutes and go to the um, go to the what to dubai the, air show to the yeah, to the yeah. dubai air show, dubai so air show. Yeah. see you at the air show and yeah. al maktoum okay. airport mm -hmm. see you guys <laughs> Can I see your name? It doesn't have a name. Oh, Minister of oh right, yeah, yeah. I think I'm the police. <laughs> <laughs> Very red. Yeah. It's red and <laughs> <laughs> it's 
It's making your eyes like that? No, no, no. It's like... It's like security check place of course we have this blah 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 expo like things so many screens but I wanted the real deal so I went outside to I went outside to see the real planes I don't want to see toys of course there's a lot of information information that I can find on the internet so I wanted to go and uh, check the plane so Let's head out and check the real deal. lot of uh, technologies, artificial intelligence, a lot of inventions. So there wasn't much, um, I couldn't see much for one day, but ah, it's quite okay. Ah, and I really, I did enjoy. So yeah. And there's a sparkle So uh, I'm here at the Asia site and um, they actually cool shows inside and if you love planes like me <laughs> this is always an opportunity like to get close the closest you can get because well at the airport you don't get to go close to these ones because of the um, because of your safety, I mean, like... The Dubai Air Show has showcased different aircraft models with over 1,600 exhibitors from more than 140 countries. 
These are in private jets, military fighter jets, and all the breakthroughs in commercial aviation.
giant model companies are Boeing from the USA, Airbus from France, which always for good reasons top the top tier in this industry. These aircraft types topping the list in commercial aviation are Airbus 330 by Uganda Airlines, Airbus 350 by Ethiopian Airlines, and on top of all them is Airbus 380 by Emirates Airlines. This bird consists of 20 rear wheels, 4 engines, with 3 class configuration. That is the Y class, J class and the F class. Bobadia, which is a Canadian manufacturer, and Ebria from Brazil are the top in private and business jets with Auras as well from Russia. Um, jets are a source of customizable luxury. Bobadia 7500 series, which costs around $70 million, is the top in the list amongst others in the jet world. In 2019, the Asho made a sales worth $54 billion. Let's see if it has been shaken by COVID or the pandemic. I have big hopes though. Uh, what do you think? Do you think the sales will remain the same or they'll, be, um, they'll drop? Comment below and let me know your thoughts. was it um, we had a free transportation from the Al Maktoum airport to the air show site and after the air show we have these buses also they brought us back to the Al Maktoum airport and we will take the bus I had a few of my friends friends right there so yeah it has been a beautiful day the sun is setting and look at the sunset I love sunset so ah. Good.